The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Beloved in faith, be sober, be vigilant, for evil is lying in wait for you, ready to pounce. It is out to get you. You've got to master it. Therefore we pray, let us begin this night in calm and present peace. us again. When we miss the beauty and the joy of Earth's goodness, when we grow too accustomed to life's busyness, when the goodness of others gets lost in the rush, when the hope in our heart fades away, when the call to serve others loses its flavor, God surprise us again. When loneliness pursues us, when it seems the darkness will never give way to the light, when the ache of the world wears our compassion thin, when the troubles of others seem more than we can carry. Walk closely with us, God. As we strive to live our lives well, as we continue to surrender ourselves to you, as we hurt in the process of loving our enemies, as we learn to accept our weaknesses and our strengths, Walk closely with us, God. As we open our hearts to the messengers you send to us, as we stay faithful to our relationship with you, as we give ourselves to the powerless, as we keep searching for the truth, as we try to live in the heart you teaching, as we accept your constant love for us, May you be the one with welcome in your smile and hello exed upon your hand, the hand you extend to anyone who blesses you with presence. Amen.
through a forest that has not been tamed and interfered with by humanity you will see not only abundant life all around you but you will also encounter fallen trees and decaying trunks rotting leaves and decomposing matter at every step wherever you look you will find death as well as life when walking or resting in nature Honor that realm by being there fully. Be still. Look. Listen. See how every animal and every plant is completely itself. Unlike humans, they have not split themselves in two. They do not live through mental images of themselves, so they do not need to be concerned with trying to protect and enhance those images. The deer is itself. The daffodil is itself. When you look at a tree and perceive its stillness, you become still yourself. You connect with it at a very deep level. You feel a oneness with whatever you perceive in and through stillness. Feeling the oneness of yourself with all things is love. Be still. Look. Listen.
Let us confess our sins against God and our neighbor. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in thought and word and deed and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, Forgive us all our offenses, and grant that we may serve you in newness of life, to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins, and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, it is night. The night is for stillness. Let us be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done. What has not been done has not been done. Let it be. The night is dark. Let our fears of the darkness of the world and our own lives rest in you. The night is quiet. Let the quietness of your peace enfold us, all dear to us, and all who have no peace. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, new joys, new possibilities. In your name we pray. Amen. The Almighty and Merciful Lord, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit bless and preserve us. Amen.